There's plenty to learn from it. I think I know from experience that you don't get too pleased when you win games and you don't get too uh, disappointed when you lose them. Um, I'd like to have, us to have played better today. Um, got some work to do, that's for sure. Um, I'm still finding my feet with it all and the instructions and I'm giving to the players based on what they're capable or what they're at the moment uh, confident in doing. Um, but we've got some, some time, not a lot of time, but we've got some time and it, it's all achievable. We've just got to get ourselves into a, uh, into a connected sense of, um, sense of mind and, and, and work together as a team in attack and in defence. And it's, it's not that complicated, but we're making it look a bit complicated at the moment. Again, it's a very good team today on a good surface. They had a real rhythm to them. Well played them. You know, they, 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 they're in a, they're in a, uh, in a rhythm, that's for sure. So, um. Anyway, some work to do. The positives are no, no injuries. The positives are that we, we, we got most players, all players, got a 45 minutes. Something that didn't play today, but 45 minutes. It takes them further in their pre-season program. Um, and I've I've experienced lots of pre-season as a player and a, and a manager. And sometimes you win them all, and then have a terrible start sometimes you lose them all and then have a great start so um, not that that's a, a formula but it's it can happen so we've got some work to do and we want to be ready for Oldham and uh, it'll give us a chance I think to uh, there's no harm in having a bit of fear about us that we've got to be better you know, it's, it's the, the squad are going away the, it's, it's a camp dedicated to football um, they're all together for the week that's it's good and bad, I suppose. And maybe they'll get sick of each other, but it's it's something that is it's it's always useful to do. Um, the new players will arrive to get you know become more familiar with their teammates, and we'll pick up the intensity of our work. And when you've got players from morning to night, you can you can you can pick and choose and and and, and actually get as much work as is possible. And you're not uh, you're not um, burdened by by schedules. You've got them the whole time. So we've got two games over there, I think, and we'll. Um, Again, hopefully we'll take our fitness and our sharpness another level up. Well, I, I think the thing with um, with signing players is it, it's so hard to predict when that will happen. Uh, you can't guarantee anything. You, you know, you, you, you search very hard for the players you want. It's constant. You're constantly quantifying. Is it the right? Is it the right decision? Is it not? Then you've got the financial element. And then you've got the dynamic of the team. What we current the players we currently have. So. Um, I've got to get that balance right. I just can't go and sign loads of players. And on the other hand, we need some. So we've already made some, some, some signings, some, some signings that I know can can come in and compete on day one, like Ryan Harley and and, and Jordan Moore Taylor, players that I know very well. Um, and you know, I'm always looking to improve the side. That will never stop. And the, the window closes in a three weeks' time. There's a loan window, so it, 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 we're in a period of transition. There's no doubt about it. And uh, you know, it hasn't quite settled. So. Uh, you know, as a manager, you're always trying to find a way of improving that team. Never say never. I mean, you know, again, in a period of transition. I'm sorry, I'm saying I don't know, but that's the reality. Is you, you, you know, even if, even if we want them to go, they want to go. Someone has to want them, or people might want them, but I don't want them to go. It's there always has to be three, three, three parties happy with the deal, the player and both clubs. Um, so there may be maybe players that. Other clubs are interested in, but they might maybe players that I don't want to lose. So it's very fluid at the moment.